got to mention this, very serious. Uh, there's been uh, dramatic developments in Ken Starr's investigation of President Clinton. Everyone's talking about this. The Supreme Court ruled that it's okay for Starr to make the President's Secret Service agents testify in the Monica Lewinsky affair. Some of them are testifying right now. Mm -hmm. It's the first time in history that the Secret Service has had to testify about the President. And the people are wondering if the President's personal bodyguard, Larry Cockle, and others are going to be forced to give incriminating evidence. Well, folks, we thought we'd take a closer look at the entire situation in our continuing series, The President in Crisis. <laughs> That's right, you're all too busy feeling sorry for Rocky Dennis to know he was involved. <laughs> He's the mastermind when you think about it. All right, well, let's jump right uh, into this whole messy affair. Talk to the man at the center of it all, President Bill Clinton. Let's get him down here. I'm good, hello. Mr. President, nice, nice to see you, oh, as always. Man. Good times at the White House. Yeah. Now, wait a minute, wait Woo. a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What do you mean, what do you mean, good times at the White House? Your, your number one personal bodyguard is at the grand jury right now, testifying about your activities. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> Kona, don't you see? That means there's a new guy in his place. It's like having a substitute teacher. The dude can't keep up with me. <laughs> What, really? He can't keep up with you? <laughs> I tell him, Conan, Conan, I tell him I need to make a private phone call, I step into my study, bang, I slide down the back pole, hop in the bubble mobile, and I'm out cruising for tail! Oh, no. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be sharing that, sir. You shouldn't be sharing that with us here on national television. Oh, man, Conan, I discovered this day's in right off the beltway in Maryland, man. Conan, Tuesday night is ladies' night, and there's some Puerto Rican girls that's just dying to Oh, come on, sir. Sir, come What's on. the matter with you, boy? All right. <laughs> sir, if we could get this back on track. Stop it. Stop it. If we could get this back on track for... Rocky Dennis is coming. <laughs> Knock it off. All right. <laughs> now, I want to get this whole thing back on track for one second. Now, aren't you worried that your Secret Service guys are going to reveal something about your relationship with Monica? No way, man. Lara Cockle's going to testify that he never saw Monica Lewinsky alone with Flapjack. <laughs> Flapjack? Is that the Secret Service code name for you? For a part of me. <laughs> Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me understand. Now, Flapjack? No, 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 no. It ain't what you think, all right? It ain't my dinger. Uh. Okay? Try to understand. Flapjack, it's like this fold of skin I've got on my back. It, it's very sensitive. It's my nerve bundle. Okay. I don't think any of us wanted to know about that. Now, now let's get into this. You're pretty sure that Larry Cockle, your Secret Service guy, Rocky isn't Dennis thinks it's cool. Oh, stop it! <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. You're gonna drive that reference into the ground. You're pretty sure that Larry Cockle isn't gonna embarrass you somehow? Hey, man. Look at it this way. I got a pretty high threshold of embarrassment. You ever seen me in running shorts? All right, sir. <laughs> the point is the Secret Service, you know? Conan, I mean... Conan, I'm not worried about my Secret Service guys. They are loyal to the president, all right? I'll show you. Get on in here, Larry. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hello there, Conan. Oh, uh, see, hello see there. That? It's Mr. Cockle, everybody. It's, uh, he's see, the chief oh, yes, sir, yes, secret sir. service Anybody? agent to President Larry Clinton. Cockle. Give it up for Highly us, trained please. agent. All right, Conan, yes, sir. I want to show you how unbelievable guys like L.C. here are. I want you to try and punch me as hard as you can. Sir, man. I am not going to punch you. No, no, it's going to be fine. Just try and whack me with Larry here. You'll Sir, see. please, I don't want to... Let know. me have it, man! It'll be fine, Conan. See, it's gonna be great. <laughs> All right, here goes. Go if you it, stay, baby. he'll protect you. Then. Go for it. <laughs> Sorry, what? Sir, uh, I didn't mean to do that. Damn! Larry, what the hell? Well, I'll, 
<laughs> I'm sorry, sir. I was confused. Sometimes, you know, you like it a little rough. Get it straight, man. I like spanking, not punching. All right, all right, all right, all right, right. Guys, let's get man. this into the issues again. Mr. Cockle, while I have you here, let me ask you directly. Did you ever see President Clinton and Monica Lewinsky alone? Well, uh, one night it was dark, a little hard to see. I thought I heard President Clinton and Monica's voices coming from the Oval Office. I walked in. Turned out to be nothing. False alarm. Just a couple of big white manatees humping underneath the desk. What? Yeah, the male, the male had a flapjack. All right. Okay. Thanks for your help, Larry. Beat it. Just get out of here. Get out of there, man. All right, sir. Man. Sir, can we get back to the real subject here? Man. You know. Look, man, can we talk about anything else? How about Paula Jones' nose job, huh? Talk about that. All right, if you want, uh, everyone knows Paula Jones had plastic surgery this past weekend yeah. right here in New York, and everyone's saying she had a nose job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's in all the papers. Look, I brought some pictures, man. This is her before, right? Uh-huh. Look yeah. at that nose, man. Yeah, okay. Whew, man, I used to beg her to do something about that nose. <laughs> Made a man feel insignificant. Right, you know okay. Saying? Gotcha. <laughs> all right. All right. I understand. Now let's play a little game. Guess what type of nose Paul's gonna choose? Now, here's some ideas. Okay. Here's the right. Carl Malden. Carl Malden, oh. Right? Okay. Now, here's the Michael Jackson. Oh, that's okay. Right. And we got the proboscis monkey. Proboscis monkey. And here's my favorite, the babar. Babar, I like the babar. Huh? All right, Not sir. Bad, huh? Sir, that was yeah. a fun that little comedy fun. routine yeah. he did for us. That's yeah. Fine, man. We could use one of those. Uh, but we're getting away from this scandal. Hey, 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 man, would you lay off already with this scandal, man? Hey, everybody's mad at me. The guy that everybody should be mad at is your guy, your Mayor Giuliani, man. Wait, why should people be mad at yeah, Mayor Giuliani? Yeah, Giuliani, man, that some bitch closing down all the topless bars and peep shows in New York City. Burn, um, baby, burn! That's, that's true, sir. Burn, Rudy! Well, uh, that's... That's true, sir. Uh, Mayor Giuliani uh, has shut down all the Conan. topless bars in New York City. A lot of man, people, very you're controversial. You're so laid back about it, man. What is Pandora Peaks or Alicia Alps going to do? <laughs> Conan, what's going to become of Busty Dusty? Uh, I... <laughs> Leave Daddy alone for once. Go after Mayor Giuliani. Oh, I don't know. Someone hey, everybody, look. Look, it's Mayor Giuliani. Someone has a problem? Mayor Giuliani, uh, welcome, sir, to the program. Good to see you, Conan. Yeah. <laughs> now, Mr. Mayor, since you're here, uh, I gotta say, it's not just the president who's mad at you. Uh, we should bring this up now that you're here. Uh, a lot of people think your plan to close all the sex shops is going too far. Conan, try to understand. <laughs> New York City is the number one city. Its citizens deserve to be saved from excessive sex. Really? But aren't you kind of suffocating the city? No. We don't want to suffocate the city. What we're doing is saving the city from unsavory... Saving... Jesus. <laughs> I didn't know. That's great that yes. people un understand. <laughs> yeah. You see, Why don't you start saving, again? What you're doing? We're saving the city from unsavory sex businesses. <laughs> Just look at the statistics. But it's a free country, sir. Don't these sex shops have a right to operate? What we're trying to do is keep our neighborhoods and our citizens separated from the sex shops. <laughs> what did you just say? You heard me, se sex... <laughs> what? Sex apps. We gotta stop this... Stop. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Sir, is it possible that you're against sex shops because you can't pronounce them? <laughs> no, I I'm against sex shops because sex, sex shops are scandalous. <laughs> really? It's as simple as that. Well, let me just uh, test my theory then. Say the word economy. Economy. What's your point? Say, say cutting crime and drugs. Cutting crime and drugs. 
Conan, this is not funny. Now, this wait. isn't amusing. Wait. Now say, saving schools. <laughs> they, 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 school. Okay, I admit it. <laughs> if I can't pronounce it, I hate it. <laughs> Very sad, Damn sir. Cool. It is very sad. I'm also against Social Security <laughs> and senior citizens. Right. Uh huh. I want to stop the stationery stores, <laughs> Sally Struthers, <laughs> and selling seashells by the seashore. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> Mayor Rudy Southwest. Giuliani, everybody. I hope he's cleared something. Up. Circus Sideshow. We'll take a break. When we come back, Jimmy Moore is going to be here. Brandy's going to be here. We got to stop it. Oh, no.